Hi guys, it's Steffi from The Novelty Corner. Welcome back to my channel. And I am sitting in front of my couch because it's after work and quite frankly, this is all I have the energy for. But I did receive two subscription boxes relatively early this month. So I wanted to share them with you guys. And since the footage of the video that I filmed originally for today mysteriously had no sound, which you know is code for Steph forgot to turn on the microphone again. I had to fill it in so I thought I'd film this after work so I'm looking very disheveled after work but I do have subscription boxes. So I have two. I have the Bookish Tees Warbringer box and I also have the Young Adult Chronicles Tower of Dawn box. So they're specialty boxes for particular books so I thought you know I'll wrap them into one neat box together and I'll do nerdy posts later in the month. So without further ado I'm going to get straight into the boxes. I'm going to start with the Wonder Woman Warbringer Bookish Tees box first. It looks like this when you open it up. It has a beautiful print on the front of Diana as both Wonder Woman and a young Diana and it's absolutely gorgeous. There is also a Wonder Woman bookmark by Words by Jasmine. I remember seeing a preview for this and this is one of the reasons why I wanted to get the box aside from the fact that there's also tea in the box but I love this bookmark. I suppose I should open the note first before I go any further. Okay, so this has a list of everything that comes in the box. So the print is by Lissy from Lissy Corner on Etsy. And yep, yeah, the bookmark is Words by Jasmine. Now onto the three teas. So there is a Warbringer tea. And this one is black tea with coconut splinters, sunflower and rose blossoms. There is the sisters in battle tea, which is a fruit tea. This one has organic cherry, banana, raisins, pineapple pieces and hibiscus flowers. Also it smells divine. My favorite thing ever is fruit teas. So I will be loving this. And the last full size tea is Steve's gift. Again, another fruit tea. And this one has hibiscus, orange peel, lemon myrtle, lemongrass and hollyhock blossoms. There are also two buttons by EA Chronicles. So let's see if I've got them the right way up. There are also bath salts by the Bookish Beauty Court. Last but not least there is a Themyscira lip balm from behind the pages uh, and that smells like Amazonian Island lilies, pers persimmon, raspberries and pear. So that is everything that came in the Bookish Teas specialty box for Warbringer. Next up we have the YA Chronicles and this is the Tower of Dawn special edition box. I ordered the one that came with the UK paperback. Blue paper inside. Oh I love the bookmark. Throne of Glass number six Tower of Dawn. There's a little card with all the details on the back. First up is a little necklace from Belle Regalia and it is a necklace. Pendant necklace and it says you must enter where you fear to tread. Which I believe is a quote from the book. So there's a gorgeous temporary tattoo from Bookmark Tattoos. I can't read the quote backwards. There is a bookmark from Read and Wonder. Very pretty. And it says, if he had not broken, then I would not break. There is also a candle from Novel Scent Co. This is the Nezrin candle. It smells of blackcurrant, plum, lemon zest, and leather. It's very strong. Then a tote from Blue Bear Bazaar. It says, a kind of hope, the most dangerous of all weapons. It's kind of creepy with the skull on it, but I kind of like it. There is also a print of Young Kale and Dorian, and I believe that is by Tara T. Jar on Redbubble, but I'll leave a link down below. You know, considering this was supposed to be a novella, this book is huge. It's over 650 pages long. Anyway. That's beside the point. This is actually really pretty in person. I like the gold foiling and it's got the beautiful, beautiful covers that are really soft and buttery and oh, I love it. And I'm hoping, hoping, hoping that Kale has a good story. I, that's all I want. I just want Kale to have a good story. So I will hopefully get to this in the next couple of weeks. It's, I don't know, we'll have to see how I go. So that is everything that I got in both my boxes for the first part of August and I'm kind of thrilled with all of them. I can't wait to start drinking the Wonder Woman inspired teas and reading Tower of Dawn and playing around with all of my goodies. I hope that wherever you are in the world, you are having a wonderful day and I will catch you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye.